The Lion of Tombstone was past his prime when he ventured north, leaving behind his maritime literature for the Klondike Gold Rush. McPhee, a saloon owner, helped successful prospectors and even transformed his saloon into housing for the poor during the harsh winter months. Soapy Smith, known for his criminal activities, met his end in a gunfight in 1898. C.J. Barry, a former bartender, struck it rich and invested in oil-rich properties in California. Harriet Pullen arrived with only $7 and built a fortune by selling pies and running a hotel. Superintendent Steele of the Northwest Mounted Police Division brought order to the Klondike with his no-nonsense approach.